The state is leveling the maximum fine against the production company behind the movie Rust for last year's deadly setting, shooting on set. Actor Alec Baldwin unknowingly fired a gun with a live round, killing a cinematographer and injuring the director. News 13's Natalie Wattis joins us with an update, including new details from the state's investigation. Natalie. Welcome. The state's occupational health and safety program reached a conclusion to their investigation of the incident and released their report today. The shooting killed Helena Hutchins, and the report says her death easily could have been avoided. Through our investigation, we determined that Rust Productions' failures were both serious and willful. To this end, we issued the maximum possible fine of $136,793 to the company. The summary of the investigation shows two instances of guns misfiring on set on October 16th, just days before the fatal shooting. The state says the first camera assistant even resigned the day before the shooting out of safety concerns, saying, quote, during gunfights on this job, things are often played fast and loose, and quote, there are no safety meetings these days. The state says Rust Productions showed, quote, a plain indifference to the hazards associated with firearms by routinely failing to practice their own safety protocols. There were several management failures and more than sufficient evidence to suggest that if standard industry practices were followed, the fatal shooting of Helena Hutchins and the serious injury to Joel Souza would not have occurred. Now, the cabinet secretary says while this concludes the workplace investigation into this matter, there is still an active criminal investigation. Now, we've also reported the family of Helena Hutchins filed a wrongful death suit against Alec Baldwin and the movie producers. We've reached out to attorneys for the family and for their reaction to this development, but if they have not gotten back to us. Kim? Okay, thank you. Now, the company has 15 days to either pay the fine or contest it. We also reached out to Alec Baldwin's management team. They did not want to comment on the decision.